bulletin board and one day we were just kind of looking at it and said wow they're going to start a radio station and they're looking for interested students to pitch in so a bunch of us said hey let's go check it out now the way things are is it's all syndicated and that doesn't happen anymore really uh, there's not really too many local radio stations and local talent it's all coming from one source or you know only a few sources Interest by, by far was the music. It, it cut through all the other parts, the, the cultural parts and the, the liner notes. There's nothing like having a live person in there, I think. And uh, it, it's too bad that you don't, like, even on commercial stations, for example, you don't have um, the overnight DJs anymore. You don't have the weekend DJs anymore. It's all pre-recorded. And, you know, choosing to make sure that Word got out for nonprofit organizations who were out there to help the community. You know, running PSAs was bread and butter for us, you know. And also, just if you listen to the station every day, you know, it's a joy. Somebody on the air is doing something that brings me a smile. And so even after I've left the station, it's still like love. You know, easily my favorite. Uh, being such a different, unique station, it's, um, you can't touch it. It's going to be here for a long, long time. To me, the highest compliment someone can give you is when they see you on the street or hear you on the street.